You know, I really need to talk to whoever, like, I buy these from, because the fact that they're leaking out the top without me having done anything to the bottles to try and screw over the customers is a bit of an issue. Hello everyone, I'm Echo, and welcome to Shopkeep. I've been very interested to play this game, and I've been looking for something nice, calm, simple to play amidst the, uh interdimensional, psychopathic, obsessive things I've been dealing with recently. I've been dealing with a lot of stuff that's put a lot of stress on me. And Life is Strange is true. Life is Strange True Colors is coming out soon. So, yeah, so much editing work to do. So much prep work to do. Fuck, I hate Sometimes I just can't. Okay, let's jump into this. Uh, okay, controller sensitivity. Let's turn you down just a smidge. Fuck this, a small window. Win window? Window. Okay. Well, we have trophy case and bananas. Apparently, why do we have bananas? Uh,. Can't do that. Okay, let's let's just not concern ourselves with what we look like. What's sex trouble between? Why do I have a secret tone in my shop? Who proved that? Uh, personal chest. No, I need uh, a weapons rack. Is that the master sword? <laughs> Is that illegal? Oh, uh, yeah, no, not yet. Why are we suddenly Skyrimming it up? Why do I... Why do I have Force Lightning? <laughs> Wait, what? Okay, put that away before you scare off potential customers. Uh, what is this? How do I get out of the back room? I'm a little trapped. Uh, poor will be here and or scrolling locks and skills. How do I order stuff? What's the paying attention? Found it. Uh, oh my god, that is so tiny. Why is it so small? Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Clear. Uh, let's just grab... Th uh, yeah. Five... Potions, right? Five. Yeah, five potions. Those should be arriving eventually. And... Is this all my shop? It's a back room, but this feels like the entirety of the shop. I put the order. Nice. So you have something. We have potions. I'm supposed to raise the margin so I can actually make some money. I'm gonna charge 15 since I spent 10. How do I get out of here? I feel like I'm in the wrong mode or something. Uh, momentarily I had three hands. Uh, okay, thanks for that. How do I. None of these doors work. Oh, never mind, that one works. Why the hell is that how you do that? Okay, let's just place these right here. One, a two, and a three. Okay, that should be uh, plenty. I may actually... Two, and a three, two, two more. A shelf. So it's not been unlocked. Yeah, let's place... Uh, Two tables. I can't place anything on. I I can't place anything on them just yet. But I can at the very least clean up my shop and uh, just have them when I can. What the hell is this? Okay, those should be sold for fifteen gold. Okay, and yeah, we should be able to start our first day. Come in, come in, shoppers. One and all, come. Come, uh, 
buy my stuff. Or my stuff is. This lady's thinking of a freaking coconut drink. What are you in there? Okay. Let's go rummage around the town a little bit. That's my house. Who are you? Super Mercy. Okay. These are upgrades. My stuff. Why are you sitting out? This seems like worse than solicitation. You're sitting, you're hiding terribly. Like, like a dollar store snake hiding behind a box and stuff in it. Trying to sell me freaking upgrades for my stuff. That's a concern. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Mmm, what was that? Okay, we sold something. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Where's the rest of this town? Actually, this is... Okay, in a small town. I thought the town was bigger than this. Let's see if I can get this. So... For 20. Since people seem to be buying it for... You know, fa fairly decent markup. Come on. There we go. Let's see if we can get that to sell for 20. Like a bit more. I really don't want to leave the freaking storefront unmanned, but at the same time, I don't really get a choice. This potion sells for 20. I'll raise these up to 25. For the time being, we'll just place them down. Oh, gee, I'll take two of them. Up them down to 15 and see what the difference makes. The music is brilliant. Holy crap, that's a big statue. Some people want shields. I can't really afford that. Come on, what are you going for? What are you going for? Ah, it was the 15. Come on, someone buy these for 20. That can make me so much more. I'm going to raise these to 16 each and see how that does for sale. See if people will spend a little bit more. No loitering. Why do we have a no loitering sign? I don't care if people lawyer outside the shop as long as they don't start trying to sell people stuff, then I'm probably gonna put that sword and Skyrim Lightning to use. You know, I really need to talk to whoever, like, I buy these from, because the fact that they're leaking out the top without me having done anything to the bottles to try and screw over the customers is a bit of an issue, because it means there's not gonna be a potion for me to screw them out of after they walk out of the shop. Where, why is no one waiting? To, seriously? Fine, fine, we'll go back down to 15. Cheapskates. Let's see if I can sell this to someone on the street for like. Uh. Someone around you. Hey, hey, you looking for a potion? Right, right? I. I have a potion. I want to see if I can sell this to someone for 30. Nothing. Nothing. Can I? How do I offer you? Um. Hmm. No. You want a sword? Do you need a potion to go with that sword? Potentially? Maybe? I don't know. Uh. Did she actually buy it? I couldn't tell. I. I, I think she did! Wait! wait. Wait, did she actually buy it? For the 30? The first person I tried to offer it to buys it? Damn. That was not what I was expecting. Um, let's buy a shield. And two more potions. For that for 60. And let's go start, try and sell this for 30 again. Ma'am, do you want this potion? Uh, hey! Oh. Maybe I should stop doing that. They're only buying them for 11. It's profit's profit, but that's not very good profit. If we don't have to pay rent, if that's the kind of money I'm going to be making. Jesus. I know I have skills, I think. Yes. 26 points. Uh, acquired 10% more, more in every sold item. Sure. Why did I... Did someone actually buy the shield? Okay, sweet. I'm gonna have to clean up the shop after the day's done. Uh, need a few more points to go that route. I want to go towards uh, money. Not sure what the other route is, though. 
Give me, let's place another order. Why do we have a sweet lullaby playing right now? I feel a little I feel a little confused on that one. Why is there a lullaby playing? I'd rather sell them for 15 here than try and sell them for 30 out there because I may only I'm probably only gonna make it 11, which isn't gonna be great. And what the hell is that? Uh, goblin, <laughs> goblin ear. Sure, if someone buys it, they buy it. Why the hell did I find a goblin ear? Why can I sift through the trash? Actually, now I think about it. On an inkwell, it's actually all that bad. It's in seed which is worth like 22 jesus oh hey you bought the shield and you bought the potion nice we're making some decent profits really quickly actually oh mana potion right or frost resist either way frost resist mana potion either way i'm gonna make a ton of money for or it's it says bought for 25, but actually every cent I make off this potion will be profit. Wait, what the hell is that? Oh, it was my potion. My potion was just glitched out for some reason. Sweet. Why is everyone running? Apparently that's the end of day one. Why did everybody run at the end? Okay, and I got a question. Let's just tie up the shop, do some ordering, stuff of that sort real quick. There you go. Okay, should be able to open for the day. I think I'm going to do another day in the, in the episode. I didn't get to say much for you today. It just wasn't much for me to say. Ooh. A bunch of arrows. For some reason. Who the hell leaves their arrows in the trash? I... Oh, Jesus. Welcome to the oldie shop. I don't think I could customize that. I probably could. I just wasn't paying attention when looking through menus. But who the fuck lost their bundle of arrows in the trash? How do you even manage that? Lady came... Hey, hey, hey! She stole that! Damn hussy. Just got in tune for that. Oh, they're complaining. You bought that. Okay, good. Because I just had someone try and steal this one. Thankfully, I managed to just shock their titties before they could get away from me. I mean, apparently, that's how you can get rid of a freaking body. Good for us. Lucky for us. The authorities will never know. That's how one of my potions got broke. This one's not saying on the table correctly either. Assholes are just kind of tossing my shit around. Did you not see what I did to the person for theft? I'll do that to someone for a whole lot less. Four more. I'm going to buy one more item. And uh, let's go with this to get more money. Okay, ooh, 144, I was asking for 120, nice, just, hey, don't go stabbing anyone with that, please, or at least don't associate yourself with me when you do so. We do not condone murders unless they're of people who steal from our shop, then we are perfectly fine with murdering every bastard who tries that shit. Got a nice big order coming on in. Uh, next few, per next few bits of coin may go towards more shelving stuff. Come on, come on, someone buy something. Buy something or I'm gonna start turning people's heads inside out. I have a wee bit more stock than I need to have. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna leave the goblins here there just for, just because it's funny. Seriously, you wanna get your head turned inside out? Thank you. you may just save that lady's life. Thinking, ooh, nice belt. Good, good, good. Every ounce of this belt will be pure profit. 
Hey! Mate, I have killed people for a whole lot less than pushing over one of my potions. <laughs> you, you wanna die? Wh who was it? Who was it? You know what? No. I don't care who it was. Who was it? Uh, you. That's what you get. That is what you get. I don't care if you were or weren't the one that did it. You're still dying for it. Nope, this... Sh this... Ooh, someone bought that belt. Nice. It's like a... That freaking... I just got an achievement. 1k gold. Apparently I made 1k gold. In general, okay. Trash cans galore. Why does everyone keep pushing that damn health potion over? It's not a very nice thing to do. Another inkwell. I'm not sure if I'm gonna put this one out because it, they don't really sell. Ever. Someone bought that sword, which is nice. I need to make this place a bit better for me to walk through. The Gussers can just phase through the shelves, which is fine by me, but, uh, yeah, I can't. No one's touched the goblin here yet, which is kind of surprised. Hey, hey, hey! Was it? Freaking bitch. Trying to steal my damn potion. I saw that. The second she saw it running, I was like, okay, get the lightning out. Get our door store pop-up team powers out, I swear to god, someone else should I steal from my store right now? You get a lot more than lightning up the ass. You'll get this broom up there as well. Make, make, make these steal less. I'm not sure that's a skill I want, I enjoy frying them. Uh, face that happens and customers become immune to spells. Oh, that's so fun. If I can't fry an innocent person, what's the point of having electrocution powers? Or lightning, as most normal people call it. Everything's, everyone's running for the hills, so that should mean... The day is up. Okay, nice. We have 531 to work with for improving shops and whatever I can get from... Uh, you know, selling these stands and stuff and then reorganizing things to make it look a bit better. So, we have a fair bit to play with. We have at least two shields, a few potions, and a few random bits and bobs to sell as well. I may make a show just to put, like, the ink wells and stuff on Goblin Air. Stuff that's probably never gonna sell. But, right now, I'm gonna end this episode of Shopkeep off here. This has been a lot of fun. I really enjoyed this. This, this is what I was looking for. Something a little less stressful that I can start playing. But, yeah, this is... You know, I when I re when I bought this game, it had been so long since I watched anything about it. I remember watching this when I was like, what, like, fourteen after school, watching IGP play shopkeep and stuff. It was just so enjoyable to watch. Um, but it had been so long since I had watched any videos on it that I couldn't remember why I enjoyed it so much. But I remembered enjoying watching, it and I thought. I thought to myself, hey, you know what? It's on sale for a good price, so why not get it? Um, yeah, I can see why it's... I can see why it's quite desirable. I, it does suck that the buy menu here is quite... Uh, has quite small text, but I think that the developers weren't uh, too entirely concerned with porting it to Xbox. Because this was originally a PC game, and I think it stayed that way for quite some time. I think there was work on a Shopkeep 2, if I remember, but I think that fell flat because it didn't really... I don't think it ever added enough, or like, something happened with it. I can't remember what, but it, it was forever ago that that entire thing happened. Yeah, for right now, I hope you all enjoyed this episode of Shopkeep. This has been a lot of fun. I really enjoy this. I, I'm gonna miss recording because recording is gonna be a come a bit of a scarcer thing anytime I'm working on a uh, prep work or working on the videos themselves for Life is Strange True Colors, which is gonna suck because I do enjoy recording, but at the same time, I love doing Life is Strange videos because it always feels like such an accomplishment to make them, especially when they get out on time with good thumbnails, with fun editing. And with just enjoyable commentary, it feels so good to do that. So I'm going to be excited to be doing that. But that's only going to last for like five videos or for however many episodes there are of that. But 
right now hope you all enjoyed this episode of shopkeep if you did think about leaving a like comment subscribe all that good stuff and that be good be well i'll see all of you in the next one goodbye